Spring is a busy time for wildlife. Time to raise a family. Most of us are accustomed to sharing our backyards with wild families. Songbirds, gray squirrels, and rabbits. But backyard foxes? They really get our attention. That was the case for Joan Warner this spring. She writes, in the past two weeks, I've seen a red fox eating bird seed thrown on the ground for doves. Do you think it was just passing through or has a den relatively close? Joan, I'm not surprised that a fox is eating your bird seed. There's not much that a red fox won't eat. And I wouldn't be a bit surprised to learn that there's a red fox den in your neighborhood. Based on my mail, it seems red foxes have become more comfortable living in suburban areas in the past 20 years. Yes, red foxes are most active at night, but spring often finds them working overtime. From mid-March to early April, females give birth to four to six pups. Until these youngsters are old enough to be left alone, Papa Fox is responsible for feeding mom as well as himself, a chore that can find him out and about during the daylight hours. So, seeing an adult fox during the day doesn't necessarily mean he's rabid or otherwise under the weather. And having a fox family in your neighborhood is no cause for alarm unless you're a mouse, vole, gray squirrel, or rabbit. Just keep the kids and dogs at bay. If she feels threatened, the female will move her youngsters to a different den site. Keep your distance and you're in for a rare treat, a front row seat to Red Fox family life. I'm Jack Hubley, News 8.